This is Richard with Wisdom Investor Travels. We're in San Diego, California, and we're just about to board the ferry over to Coronado Island. We're gonna visit the Coronado Island Resort. So stay tuned for more as we board the ferries. Thanks for watching. We're gonna board the Cabrillo and head over to Coronado Island. We're in the process of leaving the harbor here and we're looking at downtown San Diego. We just started where those two boats are. Again at the USS Midway. It's now a museum. You can see some of the helicopters used. We're aboard the Cabrillo, headed to Coronado Island Resort. Looking back at downtown San Diego. Another ferry passing us by. They do tours on this particular ferry. The Admiral Hornblower. We're slowly approaching our docking station here. Coronado Island Resort. When our boat arrived, we took a bus across the island, which is only maybe a mile or two, straight to the Hotel Del Coronado. In addition to touring the island with a bus, you can also rent a bicycle. There's a six mile trail that goes around the island. This hotel is the largest wooden structure in the United States. This is the back side of the historic Hotel Coronado. These windows here are looking to the ocean. They've got a nice ocean view. You can see the cruise ships in the background on the right side. It looks like a military boat on the left side, way in the background.
Here's the hotel pool area, Hotel Coronado. We're looking at some of the beautiful landscaping inside the courtyard of Hotel Del Coronado. The hotel is surrounded by us on all four sides here. We're overlooking the Hotel Del Coronado. We have Sally here, my wife. And Sally, what's your experience here of the hotel? Well, I would say if you're gonna come to Coronado Island, you cannot miss viewing the grounds of Hotel Del Coronado. It's just gorgeous and the beach is beautiful. I mean, just the, the way that they've manicured the grounds, the pool, just the whole setting, and it's just enormous. And the, the hotel has so much history, and they're in the middle of renovating the whole thing. So it's just gorgeous. So my recommendations, spend some time on the island here at the hotel, because uh, you'll be very uh, happy that you did, because it's beautiful. And what about the island in general? It's beautiful, too. Orange Avenue is your main drag. It's... Um, Beautiful architecture, uh, very clean, uh, no crime, you know, just in talking to some of the locals, they keep everything well maintained here. Of course, lots of tourists and um, I don't know, it's very pretty, very, very pretty. Okay, Sally, thanks for your comments and let's continue taking a look at this fantastic hotel. Yes. I'm sitting on the beach here right now, here at Hotel Del Coronado. You can see the hotel in the background. And I'm gonna have to say I've never been here before. I had mixed feelings. I've seen pictures of this place. And I thought it was just an island with this hotel that we are looking at here. And there's quite a bit more than just a hotel. There's uh, folks that live here. There's lots of shops, residential areas. Uh, other hotels, condominiums. I would say I've been pleasantly impressed on this particular island here. We're just a 15 minute ferry boat ride from San Diego. Beautiful day here in August, about 75 degrees, slight wind coming in off the ocean. Um, and so if you get a chance to come here and visit, I would definitely do it. Uh, it is a very nice place. It, whether you stay for a day or several days, I think you're going to enjoy it. In addition to the main hotel, there's also all kinds of little shops along the main drive called Orange Avenue. In addition to all the little shops and stores, there's restaurants on the main street that you can also eat just about any kind of a meal that you're looking for. There's also nice residential areas where people live on the island. We're looking at the beach here now, and there's quite a few people out there. This is a mid-week uh, day. I'm sure on weekends it must be packed. But there's a lot of folks that live on this island. They've, I met a lady, she's lived here 
for probably 30, 40 years. Her husband was in the military and she uh, decided to stay and um, met other folks here. So it's a, it's a really a, a great place. I think you would enjoy being here. Uh, lots of activities or maybe you just want to hang around. Uh, but there's you can see by the clips on this video uh, some of the things to see and do. So thanks for watching. Appreciate you watching and hope you're able to make it here sometime.